and today we will so build a Lego cargo ship. First of all, it starts with one of the boat tiles. It doesn't matter what kind. So I'm just using the Coast Guard hull. And first, we shall start on the all the cargo parts. So get. So need these two pieces. They need to be able to fit together like that. Get these pieces. One of these little diamond pieces. An Arctic set. An ice cube Arctic set. Ice cube Arctic set. Put that together to make one of those. Put that on the green one, make sure it's connected, and put it like that, and get a piece like four studs, smooth another side, put it in the centre of that, build another one. Just what you need to do. I'll just build the other one. If you want to do a third one of those, if not, don't. So they just get put on the ship. I will leave them off. There's that another one I'm going to build. Put the ship to the side. Use one of these pieces. Get one of these pieces. And wait to see. Yeah, what is. I mean, get one of these pieces, pop that in the front, one of that, these, well, two of those pieces, put that on it, same on the side, just trying to find it, there we go, they are, looks like that so far. And if you're finding this at all difficult, it doesn't matter really. Just basics, just do what I say. They are. Get one of these pieces, put on one of those pieces so it looks like that. Same on the other side. Like that. And get one of these pieces. Pop it. Wait, no. One piece. These pieces. Pop it. They are like one of these pieces, pop it just like that, same on the other side, should look like this now, get one of these longer plates, put it in like that, so at the back it should look like that, look like that from the top, so you get it doesn't matter what colour of these you use, just, oh, what colour of these you use, I'm using two whites, two yellows, so, just SpaceX, put them like that, like that, 
like that. And top, the top of it should now look like that. And this bit, you get one of these pieces. Oh god, of course, from behind. Put that right along the edge. There. Put one of these three pieces. Put it there so it should look like that. Same another side. And that should look like that. Just one more piece and you've done all the cargo parts. Same as we did on the bottom of the other, putting those pieces on. Ugh. Yep, that's that. Now for the boat, you shall start with some, some of the side of it. <laughs> this piece I got an Arctic base stamp. If you don't have it, okay, it's that turntable thingy. You only need some pieces for it. Such as here's one of them. This you need one of these bumpy things. One, it's just mine is a cord plate. It doesn't have to be. So and one of these three axles. So the legs. We see it three. Put the axle on the side. Put this and that. But don't put it all the way. This on the top, and oh, if you can put it on the top, if you can't, that's fine. Now, eight of these pieces, so four smooth plates, pop them all onto that, four per side. And then I'll show you where this goes in the boat. There, should look like that. Back the boat. And see it goes around about minus if it if it's one of those fat boats, that from the end and about that from the point looks like that. Grab your cargo. This one goes at the top. Doesn't matter what the other two go. And there's another piece I like to use in case that just goes in the middle of those two pieces. In case needed. Now for to work in the cab. Oh, no, it's alright, there's more. Get two of these plates, one of these plates, put it, put it like that. So, four, and same as the other side, sorry, no, two, just two in, so the width of one should look quite exact, and so, now you get the certain piece you use, three, well, you don't have to, but <coughs> I do it. I do this. Piece. And put it 
like that. Grab your boat again. Put your everything still up. And then you move the sled up a little movement. And make sure everything actually stays where it should stay. See the point here. This piece right where it fits. So, like that. Another piece for the front. Need one of these. Well, two of these. Two of these. They're printed. And if you ha if you want to, one of these. I'm going to. And like that. So it looks like that in the square. Out. So we can we can do your shelf. <coughs> and put them down like that. Sorry, that's just my little brother. So they fit like that. Just as you want them on the boat. See right up. You can see where they go. Now for the cap. Oh wait, no. Put these. Get yeah, four of these pieces. That's from the Coast Guard set. And put them like so. So they look like that. All four. Now get one of these, need one of these, and you get one of these pieces, put that, like that, two smooth yellow plates, put them like that. Get one of these, it doesn't matter what kind of you are using the whole scarred one. Make it look like just sorry. Put it on right at the front. No. Nope. Move those connector plates to the back. That's wrong. Move the connector plate. There needs to be room for. There needs to be two parts like that. And I put the back on. And you can put the bit I was just putting on in the front like that. B6. And get these pieces. Make sure the pattern's on the inside. That's what I can see. Same on the other side, better on the inside, and one of these plates here, put it right under the bottom there, so it fits them, <coughs> and, it, and that did two heads. And now, this piece here, put that at the front get one of these one of these pieces two little pieces put it in like that then get one of these pieces put that there and so get one of those pieces like so get <coughs> one of these pieces so one of those pieces put it on like that get one of these pieces and put it on like that now put that to the side get 
These lightsaber held on dolls. One of these and this big dish. Put this piece in the back of the dish. Put the sword, the lightsaber hilt in the middle of the dish like that. And connect the dish to the thing. Using that connector plate I spoke about. And put it on the back of your cab. So right behind the yellow. And the yellow bit goes in the front piece. In case you're wondering. Looks like. Now there's more to it. Now there's pieces to go actually in the cab. Oh. Focus on the boat. Get whatever two of these plates you would like. I've got these two. Get. It doesn't matter what colour, I'm using blue. Put them on like that. And put it far back as you can go. So put it right next to this side. Now get one of the steering wheels. I'm using yellow, it doesn't matter and put it right in front of those so it's like that now for something else that we do there we get two of these put the windows in if you don't already have them in one of these big things and put them like that on it now you get this piece another one of those three pieces put it right in front put that like oh sorry you need to move the steering wheel and things backward. Or too far forward. You just do that now, you do it as well. Then these bits they have to go in a certain place. See the front of these three bits here. They work exactly the end one. So it looks like that now. Now get one of these ladder pieces, one of these pieces, pop that piece right at the back of the boat. Wait no, there's something else. You have to go there. Get one of these, put it at the back of the boat. Get these long pieces, put it up to the steering wheel so the thing definitely stays together. Now you can put a ladder on. far forward as you can and that's the front falling off and the floor and the thing fall off quite a lot so that's just one thing to be on the lookout for and <coughs> get one of these pieces well two of them you get these computer things, put them on each, make sure they're facing the right way. Put the, one of the computers, uh, put it like that, like one of those pieces, like so. The 
other put it just on the same piece and put them right at the side where there is a gap. There's room for someone to sit there if wanted. There is room in the cab, it might ha not have a roof, so it doesn't keep in the out the rain. Still, it's a good cab. Have all these things in it. Room for one person only. That's all you can see. And the windows fall off a lot. So, just. I'll just put those back on. You've done it. Just the thing it fall off a lot. Just for you to look out. You need. If a tear falls off, just you know what to do. Now, that's that. Put it on the four things that I told you to put on earlier. So, six, like, check it out about it. You know what I mean. Easily, just fit quite easily. Put those on. Going. And there's some other things such as now there is a winch for this. Well, a crane, really, not a winch. So, this Lego turntable, put it on one of the two. Like that. Doesn't matter what side. Put that to the side. These pieces. Get. Just put any technique pieces you can. So it doesn't matter what kind of piece it is. I'm just using the pieces I have or the ones I've seen it doesn't have to be too long, too short or whatever it's your own choice of legs and just building until you think it's too long or something maybe I think that something you can think too long, too short, that sort of thing There's one thing you have to look out for that once you decide it's too long, don't just stop there because there's a certain thing you have to do. So, I'm really there. Now, the last piece needs to be able to fit one of the, the double joints. So, not a uh, and it needs to sort of last piece needs to be able to fit that. Get your turn table, poke it out and, and put it on the side that the red bits are. Okay, like so. Put that on the other side of the boat. Sorry, I just need to turn this side. It's on the wrong side. Add anything else you want to your boat if you want to say. And there's a one of those rope pieces. <coughs> Put that wherever you want inside the boat. That's just to get on and off. Oh, and this is to go in the cabin where you want it to. There, and that's it. Your complete cargo boat. <laughs>